What's up, guys? It's me, your badass here, Straven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Brown walkthrough. Okay, so off screen, I went in and did a, or made a little bit of a decision going into the Silk Cave, and that is, or the Silk Tunnel, whatever it is. Um, I actually switched out two Pokemon, one being Thrasher and the other one being Zoro for Master and Kathy. Now, if you guys don't remember, Master and Kathy happened to be the two Pokemon I traded for, one being a Lapras, as you can see right here, both water and ice type Pokemon. And yes, I did teach it quite a few moves, like Bubble Beam, Octazooka, you know, that kind of stuff. And well, Master right here, the Magmar that I traded for, I would like to say Clefairy. I don't know, it was a steel kind of a trade or something like that. It, it was a steel, basically. And it does have Ember, Leer, and Smog. Now, the only reason I didn't use these guys uh, prior to this is because, uh, well, let's see, I didn't have a second badge, and they weren't listening to me, but I, I guess now that I have a second badge, they will be able to listen to me and all that crud. So what is going to happen is, I'm going, I'm going to switch out Pokemon here and there, and we're going to see how it works right here into this cave. And, well, just like that, we get hit with new Pokemon like Cubone. Look at that. Okay, so we're going to be just running away right here. And, uh, well, if I see a Pokemon I like, I will, you know, I, I will record it and I will actually have you guys, well, notify you guys. But right now, we're just going to try and get a, a, in the, or try to get around this whole area right here. So, moving on forward, going a little faster. Okay, so I think it's safe to say that we need to use repels because, uh, yeah, the, yeah, the excessive uh, takes and all that stuff, that's just ridiculous. So, here we are moving on forward. Obviously, we're going to be using a lot of repels because we can now run and that uses up a little bit more steps right there. As you can see, we don't have strength just yet, but eventually, you know, when we do, we'll be able to move around, well, more thoroughly to this, this whole area right here. Now, there are trainers around here, and this looks like a reverse rock tunnel right here so let's go ahead and battle this guy first such a big tunnel it is a big tunnel man huge tunnel so here we go going up against a hiker and here he comes out with a diglet look a look a look yes sunny the uh good old uh ivy sore right here and yes it is a uh, crud baskets okay so let's see let's see let's see yeah let's go with the razor leaf Obviously, ground type attacks are going to be super effective against my Sunny, but look at this. Razor Leaf gets its hit. Yeah, buddy. Now, it's not that I don't appreciate re recording and <coughs> editing out these whole things. It's just, you know, it, when it comes to, I guess, Gen 1, it's just too excessive with the wild Pokemon and all that stuff. Eventually, I'll find out what Pokemon are around here. Hell, I might even catch your one or two just for the collection. But it's just a little too excessive, and sometimes I make mistakes, sometimes you just don't hear me or make me, you know, hear me do some stupid shit and stuff. And, well, look at this. We are learning Sweet Scent, finally. And, well, we're going to be switching. We're not going to be learning Sweet Scent right here because it's not really an effective move. And, well, you've lost, buddy. Let us move on right here. And, well, there's one Repel done. There we go. Another Repel to go. And, well, let's see. Yeah, these guys are positioned just like the ones in uh, Rock Tunnel. So let's see what we got. Going up against another hiker, coming out with this Geodude, and well, it's a level 21. This right here is a, you know, a sanctuary for Sunny right here because, well, it is a grass type. It is very effective against most of these guys here too. Eventually, I'm going to start using Lapras just to, you know, even out the playing field. Don't want to level it too much because remember, we still have uh, the level the level caps through badges and whatnot, and there's no items right there. So we're just going to be running around this whole area right here. And, well, there's two areas where you can actually go. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go to Kathy and see what this Pokemon's all about. Where are the Caterpies? Well, definitely not in here, and, well, we are taking on a Pokemon, uh, Pokemaniac, and he's coming out with a Slowpoke right here. I may have chosen the wrong Pokemon for this one right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch out. Let's go straight back to... Well, let's go to Bruce Lee right here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. There's a confusion attack. Good gravy, good gravy, oh gravy! That was a critical hit and... Yeah, that right there is not going to fly. So let's go straight to Ultra Psycho. 
Yeah, that right there was kind of scary because, you know, Bruce Lee is my best Pokemon right now. And, well, Disable has been disabled. Hilarious. And let's go with a Tri Attack right here. Not going to be super effective or anything. And, wow. Holy crud. Okay, so. Confusion versus Confusion. See who's stronger. And right now, Ultra Psycho is proving that. Why are you trying to disable me? You already disabled my Disable. And, well, there's another one right there. Disable again. Okay, alrighty, look at that. Okay, and he became confused. That's how you do it. And there we go. Look at that. Okay, Kathy boosted levels. Everybody's getting levels. And, well, we gotta be careful for those Pokemon trainers with a single Pokemon because, yeah. Yeah, they're, they're usually the strong ones right there. So, Bruce Lee, we need to heal this guy up a little bit. And there we go. We gotta go. Oh, wow. We should be stocking up a little bit more on potions right here. Okay. Good thing I do have uh, escape ropes right here. And there should be an item right there. And wow. We're getting attacked by a Pokemon. And it's a Grimer. Do not want to battle it. So let's move on. Okay. So let's see. Let's go with the Repel yet again. And there is a trainer right there. Let's go and use Master. I want to see something right here. Let's see what you got. Ugh, this cave is so dirty. Well, it, it's a cave. It's supposed to be dirty. Come on. It's, you know, made from nature. And look at that. We picked the right Pokemon for this particular incident. And let's go with an Ember attack just to finish this guy off. And, well, look at that. Takes a critical hit, super effective, and here comes a confusion attack. Please don't get confused. There we go. Amber attack yet again. Look at that. Okay. And good gravy. Okay, speed it. Good god. Okay, so yeah, right now I'm not loving I'm not loving life because Butterfree is a little tough right here. So let's go with the bubble beam and good gravy. Here we go. Jesus Criminy, this Pokemon is pissing me off. Okay. Alright, cut attack. There we go. And, of course, Shroomy grows to level 18. Well, ain't that great? And here comes a Venonat. So, let's go right ahead and go to Bruce Lee. Okay. Alrighty. Oh, God. Okay, okay. So, let's go straight for a takedown attack. And that one destroys Venonat. Hits us with a recoil. And look at that. Okay, so we've defeated another trainer right here. Okay, so I gotta go heal my Pokemon. I really do, because this was ridiculous. This is ridiculous. So I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, guys, so I'm back right now, and well, I did a few things along the way. I had enough money to buy myself a flamethrower attack, and so I taught that to Magma right here, and well. I also, uh, I also tie Ice Beam to Kathy right there too, so we are complete, we are set for this whole thing, and I thought I put on a repel, but look, we can actually find Ponytuz right here too, and, well, I am going to run away. Now, while I was running, well, when I was actually, you know, getting to, getting to and from this place right here, I was actually capturing some Pokemon along the way, and boy, did I find some interesting Pokemon, like, uh, you know, Onyx. I think uh, Grimer, uh, coughing and all that stuff. Yeah, we found some pretty interesting Pokemon right here, guys. And, well, you know, right now I can't capture any more Pokemon because my PC has just filled up. So, what we're going to do is we're actually going to be switching it up and we're going to be using our Pokemon's newer moves right here. So, let's go ahead and uh, cosplay this guy. Play this guy right here. Okay, so here he goes. Come, It's Pokemaniac right here and he's coming out with his Charmander. Now... The battles are getting a little more interesting as we go on right here. And crud, he's using a smoke screen right here. And, well, there goes the bubble beam. Hopefully it's strong enough to defeat this Charmander. And, well, it takes a lot of its HP right there. And, wow. Yeah. The AI is trying to piss me off right now because it knows it could do that. And, well, there it is. Defeated Charmander. And Kathy grows to level 17. And, well, let's see, about to use Cubone, and I'm not going to risk that right now, so let's go ahead and use Sunny right here. Alright, a lot of these Pokemon right here are like an upwards of level 17 and above, so I'm, I'm definitely thinking of maybe switching up some Pokemon here and there. I don't know, we'll see, we'll find out. 
soon, rather soon right here. And well, there's Cubone, defeated. And well, look at that. Okay, alrighty, so we did a good job right there. And well, let's go ahead and start using Master right here. And let's see, take it on this girl. I can't believe I got my, I lo got lost again. She got lost again. What is the matter with you? So here we go. Radita coming back, and well, let's see. Let's go with a body slam right here. Now I've been using body slam a lot just to try and capture these wild Pokemon right here. Only one of them got uh, paralyzed and whatnot. And well, look at that, level 18, pretty good. And coming out with another Radita. Let's go with Master again. Body slam for the win. There we go. And well, trying to lower my defense. It will not work. So let's go again, another body slam. There goes the good old Raditza. And well, let's see, Raticate's coming out. Let's go straight for Bruce Lee himself because we don't want to mess with this Radita or Raticate. Definitely don't want to mess with him right now. And well, let's go ahead and use double kick. And look at that. Raticate is no more. Okay, alrighty. <laughs> Yeah, you did your best, but it wasn't enough, so... Let's see, hold on just a sec. Before I move on, there are some strong Pokemon right here. Kind of need my strongest Pokemon up front, that way I don't get attacked. And, well, there's some stairs right there. There's nothing right there. The Repel has worn off, so let's go straight for another Repel. And let's move on. And, well, there is another Trainer right here, so let's go ahead and battle him. How long could this cave be? I just want to know. And, well, here we have the Hiker Always Meet here. Okay. Alrighty, so here we go, going up against Hiker. And he's coming with a Geodude. Doesn't look that strong. Really doesn't. So let's go with the Razor Leaf attack. And look at that. Razor Leaf does its thing. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty, okay. Look at that. Okay, so Geodude, no more. Okay, and then... Let's see, coming out with another Geodude, let's continue on right here with the Onslaught of Sunny, and look at that, Razor Leaf, will it do its thing, can it do its thing, yes it does, and well, there you go, look at that, and level 27 Sunny is here, and let's see, well he's about to come out with a Graveler, let's continue on right here with Sunny, and there's, I gotta admit something, they, like I do like the sprites that they added right here on this game, a little updated, a little good, uh, especially the back, the back sprites for some of these uh, Gen 1 Pokemon. I really do like the way it, they they they, uh, they included that. Plus, took out like the well, the meaningless seconds of uh, getting the trainer to you and all that stuff. And holy crud! Okay, so damn, this place right here is starting to. This place feels like the Cerulean Cave. That's what it feels like to me. And let's see, there's. One right there, and, well, the repair is worn off. I'm not taking that chance right now. And, well, let's see. Yeah, we can't do anything right now since we don't have strength, so it's time for us to get the heck out. And there is a Psyduck. Holy crud. Okay, so here we are into the next town, and this is starting to look a little bit, a little bit weird right here. Like, I've never seen this color into Gen 1... In the, into the Gen 1 motor right here. So, Alexi, where are we? Trainer tips. Keep an eye out where you're going. If needed, back to track the cities you've been to already. Okay, that, don't need that. Uh, Alexi, high school academy. Okay, so that's new. And there is a shortcut to Eagle City nearby. Eagle, Eagle Lao, Eagle Lu, Eagle Lu. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Okay, so here we are. Let's see. You know what? Town map. You got to use the town map just for this. Here we are in Moraga Town. Okay, so need to find the Pokemon Center to close this whole episode off right here. Uh, that's not the Pokemon Center, and that's the Pokemart. And gee, was crimey. They like they really make it difficult. What is this guy? You want to talk to me? Thanks. I'm very lonely. So take this thing I found earlier. We received the TM31. Okay, so what would that be? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. TM31 is Mimic. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Thank you. And this is a... Wow, okay, so the gym is right here. And the Pokemon Center is right here. Now, this is one of my biggest beefs about this game, is that they really make it find 
or they make it really uh, really hard to find the Pokemon Center now this guy right here is like that gym leader is hard no one can beat no one can beat her is that her name her my daughter may appear cute but deep inside she is a warrior hmm okay so this right here is intriguing and wow okay so they really did make it difficult for us to find the Pokemon Center so we're gonna stop right here guys in the next episode we're gonna be taking a small tour of this Moraga town and uh, maybe just maybe battling another Pokemon gym leader I don't know we shall see I'll see you guys next time see you guys